Uh, there was $29 bills, as you saw in the last clip, plus $42.15 in coins, if you can see right now. That added together gives us $71.15 after all of our expenses. How, how am I going to put this down now? Hold on. How, this isn't... Oh. That's insane. Our cash total here was 140735 I believe. We're going to... That is a lot of money. One month is what this collection is. It's one month, four weeks on each location. This is the best collection I've ever had. I'm super impressed with how this came out. Look at all this. Look at this madness. 1269. 1269. There's still a whole bunch of dollar bills in here. Alright guys. <laughs> I'm like so excited about this. So $718 in bills alone. Just bills. And ugh, like half of this container full of change. I don't know how much is in it. We're gonna take it to the bank and find out. For anyone who's wondering, this is a four week collection. This is four weeks of collection. So if I see in the comments, how long did this take? I know that you didn't watch till the end of the video. <laughs> Guys, I can't even believe this. This is my first $1,000 vending machine collection video. I'm super, super pumped that we finally cracked that $300 barrier that we've had for like the longest time. $1,048.25 is what today's collection grossed. So the last couple of videos, I've really broken everything down for you. I'm not going to go quite as far into detail this time. Claremont Subaru, we made about $325 was the gross on that. Thoughts on my mind, I can't sleep at night, so I just keep writing. I don't need no help, I don't need opinions, so don't waste my time then. I just been living online, my city don't show me no love, and that's fine. Fuck local radio stations, I got more plays than all of these rabbits combined. I'm going, I'm going again, I've been going in, I'm fed up with so many things, I gotta just let it all out. I'm talking about the shit they've been talking about, telling me I should do this, telling me I should do that, telling me, telling me things about rap, talking the truth and that stab in my back, they will knock me off. Gonna give you 254. So that's our gross between two machines, 254. Bam, first hundred. Second hundred. So it was $338.80. Alright guys, so I did not wind up sitting down and counting the money out. We went straight over to BJ's and what I did is I would grab a box and I would count the amount that was for that box and just fold it up and keep going. It turns out to be right around $160 that we had between Tire Warehouse and the airport. 
This is the hardest thing in the world to do with one hand. That's 50. I think we got less than 100 here. All right guys, so with everything said and done, we have $87.80 with the cash and with the coins. I'm gonna say 50 bucks. guys so between the coin star and the cash we have $81.50 this is a four week collection so the truth of things here you know it's not not every location is going to be awesome in fact when you start out it's more likely that every location is going to be really really bad So there was uh, $326 in that machine. Look at that. That's a full bag right there. Break everything down for you in the video. Here we go. Alright guys, so I'm going through and editing this collection video and I remembered that uh, someone had asked in the comments if I could really break down the gross, the net, and the commission, and then the actual take home. So I'm going to do that for you real quick. Um, tire Warehouse, the gross was $315 and uh, the way that I actually figure out my cost of product is I use averages. My average cost of product is about 33% of what it sells for. So I take 315 and then I multiply it by 0.33 and when you do that your answer is $103. So once I have that number I can actually then calculate my net. Um, so we take 315 and we minus $103 from it. That's going to give us $212. Now to calculate commission we're gonna take that $212, I paid a 20% commission there. So I'm gonna take that $212 and multiply it by 0 .20 or 0.2, however you wanna do that. And that comes out to $42.40. Um, when you take 212, which was your net, and you subtract $42.40, it comes out to 169.60. It's basically $170 is what it comes out to in the end. Well, good morning, America. Now for the fun part. Right. Dude, this is literally twice as much as we made the last time that we went on this collection. It happened. At the end of the day, the whole collection was 250 bucks. It was a lot worse than it should have been. It is what it is. Problems happen. Hey guys, 
So this is literally the fastest I've ever serviced this location. I hit this location and it took me 15 minutes to service the entire thing. Between the dolly and I recorded a little bit less than I normally do, but I tried to catch some screen recording at the same time. It took so much less time and the, uh, the turnover was pretty good. I'm gonna sit and count it here real quick. Okay, still need to admit that it still could have been a little bit better. It was $75 that I pulled out of the machine today. We didn't use enough product to have to replace any of it, so that works out pretty good. Get some thumbnail action real quick. I managed to get a glimpse of how much cash I had actually picked up. and it was, Most of it was all dollar bills, so I was pretty excited about that. We'll roll into that clip real quick. All right, so this week with the machines I collected, we are at $328. All right, guys, I haven't actually recorded me taking the money out of the bill acceptors. I need to remember to do that. But I'm squeezing this as tight as I can, and this is three machines right now. Uh, I think it's close to a hundred dollars. No, it's it's just about a hundred dollars, but not there yet. Alright guys, so everything said and done, we've got $145.75 in a four week period from Tire Warehouse. Significantly slower than it's been in the past, but it's still enough for me to not be too disappointed. Look at it, the thing's almost full. Wait for a second, wait, 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 wait. I gotta flex for the uh, thumbnail. Thank you so much for checking out this video. I really do appreciate it. Guys, do me a huge favor. Remember to love life, live your dreams. Be Farnsworthy.